Hello everyone, this is Yim Hang. Today, I will teach you how to make this sophisticated French dessert, strawberry mousse. To make a strawberry mousse, ingredients you will need the strawberry puree, 35% cream or heavy cream, Italian meringue, and gelatin. First, let's set up the ring for the mousse cake. I use a cake ring and I use the plastic wrap to cover the bottom of the ring to ensure everything in place and the cake board and you need to handle it like that and insert an stage on the side the same size of the ring Arrange thinly slide of strawberries around the ring If you can, selecting similar size of the strawberries for a uniform look Cover and refrigerate it. Meanwhile, I prepare the rest of the ingredients. Soak the gelatin leaves into cold water and set aside. Blend the strawberries into a puree. And I use frozen strawberries, throw puree and strain out with the seed. And I'm using the china cup or chinois. The fine mesh. Of the strainer makes this ideal for straining seeds. It takes time, but it's worth it. And you can purchase the pre mixed fruit puree at a specialty pastry store if it's available at your area. Measure out the 250 grams berries puree and set aside. Next, making Italian meringue. The Italian meringue makes the mousse even smoother and adds the glossy look. When making Italian meringue, you cook the sugar syrup until it reaches soft ball stage before mixing it with the beaten egg waste. And with the stick now I transfer the meringue to a different bowl and measure out 200 grams of meringue into this bowl. Alright, now I use the same mixing bowl to whip the heavy cream, 350 ml of heavy cream. The cream adds the lightness and richness to the mixture. Now everything is ready. Before you add the gelatin into the mixture, heat the gelatin completely dissolve to avoid lumps. I use 10 seconds in microwave and also warm the fruit puree before adding the gelatin. A warm to touch without boiling it. And gelatin leaves keep the mousse stable and hold the shape. Folding the meringue into the various mixture. Mix one third of the meringue. Make a quick mix at first. Then fold gently the rest of the meringue into the mixture. To keep everything light and fluffy, when you fold, be sure you use a gentle hand and cut through the mixture with a spatula or using a whisk and fold it over gently. Next, folding the whipping cream, I fold one third of the cream into the mixture, then pull the mixture back to the mixing bowl and make a gentle fold. Line the bottom of the ring with a thin layer of sponge cake, matching the size of the ring. Use any sponge uh, like Genoa or Choco. And today I use Choco. This is a French almond cake. Finally, put a mixture into the prepared cake ring. Make sure to smooth the top with a spatula for an even finish to have a beautiful presentation. It's also helpful to pop the cake ring gently on the counter to remove any gap. And that's it. Place this cake in the freezer at least 2 hours to set. And this cake is now set and remove the plastic. I apply an apricot glaze on the strawberries to look shy and prevent from drying out. Now 
prepare for slicing. Yay. And remove the acetate and place the cake on the plate. Wow. Voila. Dessert time. It's creamy, smooth, and light with a refreshing strawberry flavor. Yeah, I'm in heaven. <laughs> Thanks for watching and see you again on the next video.